So guys, welcome back to the channel. Touching down from the glorious sunshine of Chiang Mai City. That's right, we've got sunshine back. The rains have disappeared and hopefully they're not coming back. Today, we're going to look at another property, man. We're going to the Pan Suk condo, urban condo, which is just off of Hoi Khao Road. I've, I've stopped up the top of the road a bit and I'm just going to show you around here. So up here is Hoi Khao Road. So just turn off Maya Moor. It's just two minutes up here. And we've got the famous dome here. The dome is a place that I came to look at. And it's always one of the first, <laughs> first places that comes up. When, when I used to look online, I don't know about anybody else, but these places are the ones that are just so familiar to me, the dome. Just show you the end of the road here. It's early morning, well not too early, about 9, 10 o'clock. And Hoi Cow Road baby, May and more just earned it. Got these apartments here that are cheap as well. And going down there, going down to the moat. Right, so we're going to walk down it and it's a good area once you turn off, turn off the road of Hoi Cow. So there's loads of places down here. You got a place down there lit. You got the cozy rooms for rent. That looks like it's down this way as well. But this is the urban pan suk that we're going to look at. So you turn off another small road. And it's, it's really quiet, right? Quiet down here and you're right near everything again. You got the mayor, you got the niman. This is the pan suk urban condo guys. This is another one that I know so well without actually going in. So this will be cool for me just to have a look. It looks like they got some different size rooms. Pansuk, the urban condo. So I'm just waiting for my friend to turn up and then we should go and have a look at the rooms and I will tell you everything, the prices, the rent, and everything you need to know. So I'll show you the lobby while I'm just hanging around here. Yes, not much of a lobby. Got another small office in there. It's quite a bit of parking. And it's a key card jobby, as always. So there's the pan suk, and right next door, got the cozy which looks a nice place, doesn't it? It's the same sort of building and look at the size of the balconies. I might come back and have a look at this place in the future. Well, it's not a balcony, it's just a, just a walkway. But yeah, it's even more quiet back here. So that's another one we could look at sometime. Right guys, so it's a false alarm. I went to the wrong pansuk. This is the pansuk we're looking at, which is just, it's the next road along. So there's two pansuks. And I really wanted to look at that Pansuk Urban because that looked really nice. But this one looks cool as well. And we got the owner here and he's going to show us around. So let's do this. So this is the other Pansuk. It's nice as well, isn't it? I come down this road quite a lot. There's a lot happening down here. And we're not too far from um, the Donut Cafe where I went and got my breakfast in a bun. So there's two pansuks guys, don't get mixed up. The other one's pansuk Arabian. Right then. This one looks really nice as well. We've got the owner here, Thai guy. Nice lobby. So obviously it's the same, the same owners as the urban condo. They just got two places. Okay. Thank you. So we're gonna have a look at this guy's room. Thank you. This is a room in the pan suk. Ah, it's a big room. Yeah, it's a bit dark. Thank you. 
Wow, this is big. Jesus Christ, man. It's really big. Yeah. So what are we thinking, people? You got your desk here, look. Nice, spacious living room. And out here you got a balcony. So this looks like it's a corner, corner one. It's not actually a balcony, but you can get out there, look. You just jump over the window a bit. This is the corner room. It looks a little bit noisy. You're down near Chai Mansion, look. This is quite a busy area. Once the window's closed, you don't hear much at all. And this is the bedroom. A nice size again, isn't it? Very nice size. Got your wardrobes. All nice again. It's not like it's old or nothing. And in here, Jesus Christ, that is a big bathroom. That is probably the biggest bathroom I've been to. Look, look at the space in that bathroom. Oh, and a proper divided shower. A proper separate shower. So I'm glad I come to look at this place. It's a place that I would never have looked at otherwise. It's big, man. It is big. So I'm expecting quite a big price. This would be really good for me. Desk. And look, you've got a proper table. Proper dining table. And your kitchen. I would say all this comes included as well. Your cooking hob, microwave. The kitchen area looks a little bit old, but what's that, eh? It's not like it's dirty here, it's clean. And you get your own, your own washing machine. So yeah, I thought I was gonna look at the other pansuk, but it's all good, man. It don't matter, does it? It's good to show anywhere. This place was, I think it's gonna be a little bit more expensive, but I wanna chop and change the places I show for different people in different different sizes because you're not going to get somewhere like this for four or five thousand the size of this place so the good thing about this place the size perfect for you know small family big family everything included that's another plus and clean location there is there's nothing wrong with this place, really. Would I live here? Nope, not this area. Would I live in this apartment if it was somewhere else? You're damn straight I would, if the price was right. There's nothing wrong with this place at all. So we'll find out the most important thing, what you're all saying. Wayne, how much is it? Find out how much it is. Right guys, so I've got some prices and this place is 15,000 a month for a three month contract. It's 13,000 a month for a six month contract and 12,000 a month for a one year contract. So yeah, you, you're saving about 1,000 on a one year contract. So you probably wouldn't stay here for the three month contract would you 15,000 a month maybe it's a big place it'd be good for a family or sharing or something but yeah it's 12,000 a year 13,000 six months like I said I want to show different price places because we're not all the same are we some some people want a bigger place pay a bit more okay so now we're gonna go and look at another room on the seventh floor and we'll just see what that one's like i think it's the same size and the same same prices but now we're here we might as well go and have a look at eh? this one here yes okay so this is another room that's a floor above the other one that's a little bit different layout well no it's not it just got some furniture missing from here that's why it looks bigger here exactly the same I like the desk here more. You get an office chair here as well. That'd be pretty cool workspace, wouldn't it? With the with the window right behind you and the balcony. I like that. So yes, yeah, the same 
the same layout guys I got pulled down there that's across the road I forget what that place is now yeah, it's, it's a bit old I don't know if I'd like this view looking out over this I wouldn't mind going over to use the pool though the pool looks quite clean but no I wouldn't like that at all I like to be truthful for me on this channel I'm sorry if it's a bit dark in here guys because the lights they're hell of a week man so you probably want some bit better lighting in here you get all your cooking stuff again I'm not going to stay too long in here because it's the same it's the same as the other one so I'll just show you what's around here it looks pretty empty actually and we've got a more shop of there. No, that's the office. Can't get out there, guys. So it's a bit off the cuff today. Uh, yeah, there's not a lot. They haven't got a gym or anything. So I'll just show you the parking here. They've got underfloor parking, which is always a bonus, right? You come on down. They got. It's not a massive car park. I would say the cars would get pretty full up soon. But the bikes are a nice place for the bikes. Look can park here no problem so I should have parked Lucille down here really but oh well ah there you go people let me know what you think there's nice big rooms we went to the wrong one first but I think I'm gonna go and have a look at that one as well anyway I'm gonna stop waffling let me know what you think of the pan and I will see you in the next one so take it easy man take it easy